Good morning. This morning we'll be cleaning our Epson print heads using a Workforce 3520. Start by clicking on the start button in the lower left corner. Then we click on devices and printers. Due to this low screen resolution of the computer we're working on, we're going to go ahead and maximize a window by clicking up on the maximize window button in the upper right corner. Then we'll right click on our Workforce 3520 and left click on printing preferences. Inside printing preferences, we'll click on the maintenance tab and then click on the nozzle check. This is going to print our uh, test print pattern that we're going to use to determine which colors. And we're going to go ahead and click print and compare the output to the output shown on the screen. We're going to go ahead and clean our print head. Now, print head cleaning is typically have to be done due to a printer sitting for a while and is especially true in a dry environment. Alright, based on our output sample, we're going to determine whether we're going to use all colors, we're going to print just uh, the colors, or just the black. And um, we click start. And we'll speed up this process here for you because it does take a little bit of time. And then once the uh, cleaning is actually done, we're going to go ahead and print another nozzle test pattern. And we're going to do that by clicking on the print nozzle check pattern button. And again, we're going to compare the output to the output shown on the screen. Once we have a good pattern, we are done. And we click on the finish button. our menus out, our windows out, and click OK, and then go ahead and close that window. And we're done. Congratulations, you now have clean print heads.